Well, I asked you this. I asked, I asked, um, and and I asked Kiki, Lil Kiki, who would win in a versus between him and uh, him and Slim Thug. So I asked you who would win in a versus between you and Lil Flip, because mm. y'all both got a lot of music. I mean, versus is more. But I got. I had to ask you. Yeah, yeah. Vers, versus is more of just like playing songs. Yep. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Feel like kinda, we was getting old. We was getting old. Yeah. That's kind of how they felt. How did you, um, uh, well, I asked you this. I asked, I asked, um, and, and I asked Kiki, Lil Kiki, who would win in a versus between him and, uh, him and Slim Thug. So I asked you who would win in a versus between you and Lil Flip. Because mm. y'all both got a lot of music. I mean, versus is more. But I got. I had to ask. You. Yeah, yeah. Vers, versus is more of just like playing songs. Yep. You feel me? Mm-hmm. It has nothing to do with the artistry or the. Well, creative. you want to talk about well, who gonna win in the freestyle battle? No, I still want to hear the verses. It, it has nothing to do with the artistry or the creativity. You mm-hmm. feel what I'm saying? So, man, of course I'm gonna say me. You feel what I'm saying? But how would you take him out? That's what I asked, Lil Kiki. I'm asking you. Just, how would you take him out? Now, even though you might have been nationwide. You ain't got nothing that's fucking with swinging and banging on man. Okay, okay. Then you gotta get your hands up. That's a bad bar right there. You know what I'm saying? Then you, you, it's so many. You know, you know, new wave south side to hold. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about. Then we go OG shit. We go from smoke on. Go oh, that's a bad boy. Candy yeah. coated excursion with Slim, Braids and Fades. Yeah. Uh, uh, you know, it's, it's a whole bunch of shit. Oh, you yeah. know, go to the rake shop. We ain't even got to the rake shop. We ain't shop. got to the rake shop. All the rake shop songs. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, uh, even though we might have more the, the nationwide deal, yeah. you know, it depends on the the, dem- the age of the crowd. Okay, okay. Now, if it's a bunch of white kids, he might win. But if it's, if it's, if it's, it's our people, there. some niggas in there, I'm going to win. <laughs> Man, I just had to ask you that, man, because yeah. you guys do so. Y'all, the South needs something like that, really, yeah. to me. You know, we got to do something to keep this 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 whole energy, you know, flowing. Yeah, we're supposed to be put together a show. You know, it's supposed to be like a it, Switch House and SUC big concert versus, you know, hopefully it's going to go down I'm during the screw week. I so. sure want to see that, I'm man. Yeah. So, will we ever see any more work from you and Slim, another uh, Boss Hog Outlaw album or something like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. I mean, hopefully. You feel you know, me? I'm and just Slim, asking. cool. We've been cool. So, we talked about it, but, you know, he trying to finish up what he got to do, but, you know, he on the new album. Oh, you yeah, know, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, oh, him and Killer doing their thing, you know, but everybody know that original Boss Hog Outlaw is me and him. Yeah, you know oh yeah, saying? for sure. For sure. So, That's why know, I asked you, you know. He he probably wanna do it if his money ever get low. <laughs> <laughs> you know, boy, yeah. nigga do a lot of things, that money get low, oh, boy. Yeah. As long as he bothers. Go back to the basics, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But you know, it is what it is. That's my doubt. What made you go from Perry on to sign the wreck shop? Man, Perry on, man, when I I saw so many of them when I got locked up, I came home to nothing, bro. Yeah. I had to sue them to get my I won the, the rights to the to 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 swing and bang and all that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Them boys ran through like two, three million when I was locked up. Drop top bins, Versace jeans, Rolex, everything. So I came home with nothing. You yeah, feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Then people don't, didn't understand that struggle. You feel me? And so then I dropped Return Living Dead mixtape slash album. And Rick Shop, you know, they had good structure over there at the time. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? So. That's what that was why I made that decision. Yeah, it went, it went hard too, though, man. Still cool with D-Rick? Yeah, yeah, we cool. Already, I just did a song for the new Dirty Third. Already. Wow, yeah, man. So, which one of your albums the biggest album that you ever dropped? Uh, man, that's your that's your opinion. It's, it's I mean, on you. Biggest being the most set. I don't was, know oh. to you, man. The, oh. Man, I, Ocean of Funk got to be one of one, 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 one. That's the most important one. <laughs> that's the most important uh, one. Me, me and Slim, man, did. Y'all killed that was, it. That, that was a big, hell of a battle. Uh, Sit on the Seas did real good, man. I, you know, she really rhymed did. I mean, you know, Shiny Grind did really good, but Ocean of Funk go for like $150, $300 right now online. Ooh. Yeah. You know, I, re, I re-released the wax, like, once every other year, only like thirty-five to fifty copies. That's it. 
You know what I'm saying? Like exclusive thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And they be like, they go like $100 right up top, da da da. But the, the CD or the cassette for Ocean Phone, that, you, you gonna pay 150 to 300 for mm. Wow. You got some. Uh, yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.